Hi, uh, my name is Roy Shukhami and I wanted to share with you a great success story of a retail chain working with Ecstasy Analytics. To give some background, it's a 90-store retail chain selling luxury accessories. Stores of 60 to 80 square meters, relatively low traffic, and an average sale is about 3 to 500 uh, USD. Now, a bit about us. Ecstasy Analytics is a super innovative company that does one thing only. We translate surveillance into actionable business analytics means we integrate the surveillance cameras that are already installed but almost never used. And by smart combination of human observation and technology, we provide real-time insight, real-time analytics to the top management, and real-time tools to act to the stores and area managers. So back to the success story. First of October, we connected analytics to 20 stores. 10 got a brief on ecstasy analytics, and the other 10 were not aware that we are observing. Three weeks later, these were the results. 25% difference in sales between the two groups. 66% difference in lost clients, means clients that went to the store and got no service. And there was also a very clear difference in the amount of time that the employees were present in the store and the quality of their service. On the 21st of October, we briefed the second group of store managers. So all 20 stores got real-time info on how well they perform. One week later, the conversion rate of the new informed group increased dramatically, means sales were up in almost 20%. And in all 20 stores, the service was improved and the employees were following the sales protocol in a much better way. A few months later, the results remain pretty steady. Top management are using analytics on a daily basis, and area and store managers use this innovative, real-time tool and knowledge to keep improving. You can have a look at the written version that goes more in depth in this uh, success story. And of course, if you drop us a few words, Ecstasy Analytics team will be more than happy to help. Enjoy the day.